Good evening. Many suggest suicide, the act of taking one's own life, is a permanent solution to a temporary problem. Acting Deputy Director of Family and Social Services, Fiona Charles Richards, assures circumstances will improve. You're not alone. You are not weak for feeling the way that you're feeling. I or no one else knows what you would have gone through. The World Health Organization estimates close to 800,000 people worldwide kill themselves every year. That's one life lost every 40 seconds. But what could lead someone to a point where they feel the need to commit suicide? Often, individuals are unable to cope with life stresses. They may have been abused or feel isolated. Richard says there are warning signs when someone exhibits suicidal behavior. The person may have already started cutting, for example, or may have been uh, already engaged in self-harming behavior. She shares international statistics regarding suicide rates. The majority of the suicide cases that have been identified are between the ages of 14 to 27. But what can we as concerned citizens do to make a difference? So the first thing, Please don't leave them alone and get them help, whether it be from a counselor, whether it be from a psychologist, whether it be from a psychiatrist, whether it be from going to the ER. Those are some things that we really need to do in order to get persons help. Rakib Aparicio reporting for ABS News.